Yo, what is going on, everybody? My name is Earl Shot, and welcome to some Black Ops 1. That guy got panic knife. Climb up the ladder. Oh, this guy's climbing up the steps. Gets the M16 through the pelvic area. <laughs> oh, man, I had too much fun playing Black Ops 1, man. I found this gameplay, man. This gameplay is like a year and a half old. It's on my file share, but I never uploaded it, and it was brilliant. Just a funny gameplay. You guys are going to watch this, man. I start off so well, so well. I think I'm like 18 and 0, 17 and 0. And then a series of unfortunate events happens, and no, I'm not talking about Lemony Snicket and his bucks. Ha ha. So, <laughs> uh, yeah, M16, man. It's just a solid rifle. It makes me feel all patriotic and whatnot. All right, guys, we have a topic for today. I'm not just going to be rambling on about the game play and stuff of that nature what I want to talk about is expanding your horizons and also the impact of relationships so um, first and foremost you, if you ever notice at school or something unless you're a really weird kid uh, the first thing you talk about with your friends and stuff is not it's like school yeah yeah and you also talk about like TV shows games you play together things you do in common and uh, for a lot of the group I hang around we all are big sports players right we're athletic people we like watching sports and whatnot and uh, I feel kind of bad because anytime the conversation or a conversation with other people goes to the NFL I just kind of cower in the corner and uh, shut my mouth but here is where I want to change it's like a mid-year resolution or actually this year is actually about two-thirds done so it's a two-thirds done resolution man I'm, I'm gonna be more open about other fishing sports so I think I'm gonna start watching some uh, some NFL this year and uh, okay so that was my first death right just watch this is gonna be a series of deaths you're gonna watch it's just it's oh man it makes my head spin and my kneecaps erode so yeah I want to start watching NFL I don't know why it's so popular and like I, I don't like being left out of the loop and uh, it's a fun sport to play, at least when you're playing and not getting tackled by 300 pounds, six foot seven, white and Mexican and black and Asian men. I don't know why I brought race into that. <laughs> it's just stupid. I just when I'm on this mic, dude, things just flow out. And uh, yeah, so that guy killed me as he was camping. I spawn. I tomahawk the car, and this ghost guy flutters around the corner like a butterfly. I spawn again, and this freak with his backwards hat and his dumb emblem kills me and I'm mad man cuz when arrow shot dies in a video there are going to be some consequences up in here yeah I guess I just get mad shoot this guy headshot pop his head right off and I know there's a guy right here because this UAV helps me camp and shoot this guy's brain off so yeah man so I've said so about 30 times right now I'm gonna stop that I, I noticed you guys really like the face commentaries I did the live commentaries where I had my face in and to be honest, those are really fun to do. And I haven't sat down and did a commentary in a while, so I guess I'm kind of rusty right now. And I'm not sure exactly what to talk about. <laughs> but yeah, that's just me being candid. And uh, sometimes I find that the best things, the best commentary, or the best, your best results happen when you're just being yourself and you're not trying to be perfect. I don't know, it's just some two cents. So yeah, I also want to talk about relationships. Um, one thing I noticed that's really huge on YouTube is not only what you do and the uh, content that you create, but it's also the people you know on YouTube. And look at this, dude. I'm one kill away from getting the final kill, and I can't freaking get it. <laughs> Keep dying. It's ridiculous. Um, so, yeah, uh, I guess uh, just be nice to everyone, man. Just watch other people's stuff on YouTube. You don't, you don't want to be a hermit ever in life. You can't, you can't get along with just doing your thing. Uh, maybe you can, but um, always, always be open to other people and watch their stuff. If you're, other, if you're a content creator like me, that's something I had to learn the hard way because uh, for a while I just stopped watching videos. And I guess uh, it showed on my channel because my views kind of dropped. But yeah, I started watching other people's stuff. I kind of know what's going on in YouTube again. I'm relevant. And that's it, guys. Hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching. Let me know down below. Yeah, that's right. Here is a question for y'all. What do you feel like you're out of the loop on? What are you not in tune with? For me, it's National Football League. Uh, so I kind of want to get into that. And uh, yeah, let me know down below. What are you not so 
interested in or what are you interested in but you don't know a lot about let me know down below and here is a halo clip for your enjoyment it is a fail and you guys are successes haha <laughs> that was that was pretty smooth if i must say all right i'm gonna leave this is arrow shot and i'm over and out oh, oh. yes Did you, oh how you didn't see that jump that was epic i, saw it, I, saw I just it. jumped from s3 to sword Sword, yeah, I got it. Uh, I got stuck. Watch your, watch your, do it again. I'm gonna watch you. Oh my goodness. That's crazy. What? The, I got hit markers. Oh, it's teammate. Ha! Come on, do it again, Nathan. Yeah. Oh, oh he's here! Ah! Ah! <laughs> you got stuck. I stuck him too, but you jacked my kill. <laughs> that was hilarious.